Hello, this is Haku the Bean, and today we are going to be reading about the backwards level known as the Blue Channel. If you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get right into this. The Blue Channel. Survival Difficulty, Class 3. Unsafe, unsecure, low entity count. The blue channel is the oddity filled of void that surrounds the entirety of the back rooms and all of its levels. Description The blue channel is an area that exists outside of all levels in the back rooms. It is comprised mainly of a disorientating blue void. The void is completely absent of any shading, other colors, or patterns, thus making it one singular and disorienting. In color, no matter what direction or axis it's viewed at. Auto tests have shown that the blue channel is 99.9% dead space and devoid of atoms. One can float seamlessly, no matter the y axis. Any water will be able to swim through the blue channel as if they were swimming within a body of water. One must be careful when traversing, however, as one can easily flip themselves and become disoriented and confused as to what they are, are facing. To compensate for this, one should always have some sort of hand hub or gyroscope on their person. When one in an initially enters the blue channel, the view of countless levels can be seen from behind. Depending on the construction of levels, one may see the different level exteriors. Interestingly, the exteriors of the installation are not visible from within the blue channel, leaving only the main levels themselves visible. If a level takes place in the exterior setting, then a large skybox-esque dome will surround the, the area of the level. This does not include the real world. We are not flat earthers. With a thick platform of whatever grad material the ground of the level is comprised of underneath the skybox. If a level takes place in a large yet finite interior level, the walls of countless rooms can be sighted. If that level happens to have doors, and, and there will be doors that lead to the interior of these of those levels. These doors can also be exits, which are elaborated upon later in this article. If a level is infinite, then we'll, we'll see the end of the level. The key difference, however, is that the rooms will constantly fluctuate and change in size. Well, as size rooms change, the space it, it never seems to extend beyond a certain distance. This creates a strange effect of how one would view fourth dimensional objects when perceiving them in the third dimension. Anomalous level states. Level 232. When one is seeing level 232 from the blue channel, one will see countless distorting rooms and imagery with chunks of the level occasionally breaking away and scattering into the eternal void. Level 6.1. When viewing level 6.1 from above, the interiors of the various bars and restaurants flash in different colors rapidly. Current studies, current studies show that this occurrence actually shows multiple bars inside of e each other, no clipping and other people flashing in and out of existence. This effect, however, is invisible within level 6.1. This seems to be showing in the way a wanderer can walk into a store and exit to a completely different store than, and that store was never there. Level 18. When viewing level 18 from the blue channel, the perimeter of the level takes on a white glow with black outlines lining the walls and objects. This is due to level 18 structure altering per person and per memory. Level 38. When viewing a level 38, it will take on the form of various rooms rapidly folding in and on each other into the epicenter of the level itself, and an effect not seen when inside of the level. Level 2957. When viewing these levels, you may see giant rooms of a level that is being portrayed behind the paintings of said level. This room will dematerialize when close in range, or will rematerialize in an instant when viewing from a distance. Level 444, the walls of level 444 will never have any definite form and will always appear as white noise static when viewed. Level 600 and level 907, due to both these levels no longer existing, 
Where they would directly exist has been replaced by nothing but an, more than blank space and empty air. Scenes. While a majority of the blue channel is comprised of an endless void, there are, are the occasional cluster of buildings or rooms that can be found within it. There are the occasional pockets of structures are, are spread throughout the infinite void. These structures are usually be small. All clubs of skyscrapers, houses, streets, miscellaneous rooms, or any combination of the aforementioned possibilities. When entering them, one may notice the sky changing color to resemble a hazy fog. For this reason, it has been concluded that each of these areas are surrounded by some sort of form of atmosphere or a different anomalous effect that allows for the creation of a sky and fog. While these things do look as though they exist, they will oftentimes not be made of cleverable matter. Cleverable matter is a collectible term or used for objects that cannot be held or attached. And you've, you've passed through with ease. Now, this does not mean, in, it, however, this does not account for all walls within these landscapes. With select ground having material that can be walked on, interacting with this ground is heavily advised against as such as exploring the, its deployability that one would previously have. If one accidentally walks through non clippable matter, they will fall out of the scene and be doomed to an eternity of falling through countless level clusters. Why these areas exist is unknown, however, many theories have been created on this, this subject. Those theories are discussed further down in the article. Basis, outposts, and communities. The Stranded. The Strand are a group of stray explorers who actually ride up on this level after exiting a door on the edge of level 26. They found a small patch of livable matter inside a scene where, in which they reside. All details of this on this group come from a forum page they created where they ask for help and document their lives. It is currently unknown if they are, are still alive since the amount of food and supplies they had was never specified. Theories on the scenes. It has been heavily contested what the possible meanings for the different areas for throughout the Blue Channel's void could be, with no concrete evidence to reach any logical conclusion. All that is currently available are various ideas and shrugged together untested at parallels. They are as follows. There are broken parts of other levels. This idea proposes that some areas of pre-existing levels, as well as any other, as well as any currently unknown levels, have parts of them that progressively break away and are replaced. Much like an item with an atom with a large number of electrons, and some of the outer sections of levels may break away due to a lack of force holding it together. As such, these areas drift away into the blue channel where they start to decompose. Levels under the under construction. Another proposed idea is that not all the back rooms ha levels have always existed, and said that they're made procedurally by some unknown method initially initially starting out in the blue channel. These levels slowly grow and develop into a finished state, being placed into an appropriate location in level list. An exception of this theory is that all levels start off with non clippable matter, with the clip boundaries being implemented at unknown stage of construction. This could also explain phasing as certain level well, as certain areas of levels may not be given proper clip matter. Clip boundaries, I mean. Dying levels. This theory proposes that these levels are levels that have existed for so long that they started to decay and wither, much like how the previous level 232 is showing signs of decay. There is a chance that other levels have decayed also, being cast out into the blue channel once they lost most of their mass and clip boundaries. The start or the end of the backrooms. Due to the backgrounds possessing peculiar or temporal effects, it's entirely possible that one transports us to a time prior or to the existence of the backgrounds, or at least to a time where it was nothing more than small conceptual areas. This theory was brought into question has brought into question the true age of the universe, as well as the idea that most of us have only existed for a few years, with everything before that essentially being lore to our reality. They're nothing at all. Much like how the backrooms itself operates in peculiar and peculiar ways for no discernible reasons, it's entirely possible that these areas exist because of the natural way the blue channel operates. 
While this doesn't pose much in the way of discussion, it's currently the most digestible and easily understood concept of why these scenes exist at all. Entrances and Exits To enter the, bl enter the blue channel, one can reach the end of any level on the level list and either o-clip or walk through a door or the outermost rooms. While these may take one to the installation, they have an equally possible chance of teleporting a traveler to the blue channel. As well as the entrance, as well as this entrance to the void, it can also be found in select areas of the decay zone, the blue slides of level 1 and 19, and the disintegrated areas of level Acrom um, Atom Umali. That is a hard word to say. Road to Ruins and End of the Freaking World exists here too, but now we can't let people know about that, let's just keep that all away from the public. With what we know about the leaders and what we ha happened to them, it'd be chaos if others found out about them too. Exits If one is to remain close to the level list, they, and they may be able to enter or face or use the door into any level they see fit, while currently unproven, they could, they're like, they could theoretically be in a extremely quickly a means of transportation throughout the back rooms. No kidding. That was the Blue Channel. A place where you can view the levels from the outside. It exists in a void outside of the back rooms. If you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I have absolutely no idea what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, so until then, goodbye!